Hey guys, what is up and welcome back to the Orlando Magic series here on NBA 2K22 and now last episode we started our second season with the squad we played against the Bulls and we simulated up until this Wizards game because I wanted to play the Wizards Kyrie Irving's now on the Wizards uh, if you look at their team on the right there uh, their lineup looks like Spencer Dinwiddie, Jaden Hardy, Kyle Kuzma, Davis Bertrands, and Jonas Valanciunas. Well, the reason for that is because Kyrie had to go and get himself hurt. Yep, hyperextended right knee day to day. I don't know how long it is, so I'm going to simulate to January 1st. We're going to go into the new year. If he's not healthy by then, I might cry. Look at us. We beat them without Kyrie, so with Kyrie, we might beat them. I don't know. We beat the Bucks. Okay. This Magic team might be the real deal. We've been playing very, very well. We are the second seed. We just lost to the Bucks there again. Of course, they jinxed it, but we're 2013, which is like the last time this team was relevant, and there you go. Kyrie Irving is now healthy, and he is backed up by Jaden Hardy, Kyle Kuzma, Rui Hachimura, and Jonas Valanciunas lineup has switched a little bit with Kyrie back in the rotation, and we, well, you already know our We've been winning a couple. We, I mean, we've won most of our games since we changed these lineups. I'm also going to put on the brand new city jerseys for both teams now. I will admit, I hate the Orlando Magic uh, city jerseys. I think they're, you know, vomit worthy, but Washington Wizard ones are very, very clean. So we're going to jump ahead into this game, test out the new jerseys, and hopefully get a W against Kyrie Irving and, well, most likely Rookie of the Year, Jaden Hart. We are here in Orlando once again. Another home game. Kuzma, I do not care. Look at the Orlando Magic, man. I So here's the thing with the new city jerseys. They were recently dropped. I'm sure most of you guys have seen all of them, if not most of them. I'm, I'm going to be real. I... The Magic jerseys might be the worst ones. Um, it's really unfortunate that that's who I'm doing a series on, but these might be the worst city jerseys in the league. Um, the Celtics, unfortunately, are pretty bad. As a Celtics fan, I hate to say that, but they are awful. The Wizard ones, I really do enjoy. I'm not going to lie. I might get myself uh, a Kyle Kuzma Wizards jersey. You know, Kuz Control. Speaking of Kuz Control, last year in our Jason Tatum, my career, he was on the Magic. So this is a funny, uh, you know, we're going to see our buddy Kyle Kuzma again. We love Kyle Kuzma around here. I don't know why, but he's slowly turning into one of my more favorable non-Celtics players. Now, he'll never be on the level of Jordan Nora, but Kuzma, man. Kuzma and go. But back on the topic of jerseys, personally, some of my favorites are the Kings jerseys because they're short. They, dude, the Kings shorts are so nice. Kyrie Irving, why don't you have to steal that ball? Look at him. He got a haircut. I'm used to seeing the long, like, afro Kobe because they're not Kobe Jesus I can't believe I just said that Afro Kyrie because in 2k uh, my team he was the Afro version for quite a bit there Suggs can we get around we got Kuzma on us come on I love Kuzma but come on come on what's he know about defense nothing easy through okay we missed it's all good Omer you're at seven way to save the day give me that give me that steal H Hardy you ain't nothing bro I ain't worried about Hardy only Hardys I care about is Jeff and Matt my guy so come on show me what you got Swanton Bomb, baby. Yeah, exactly. Kyrie, though. Kyrie, though. Nice little lay. I can't stop that. Kyrie's just Kyrie. The Warriors have really nice jerseys. Uh, Houston Rockets jerseys are really clean. The Lakers, I'm, I'm indifferent on. I don't know how I feel about those as of right now. Can we give it back to Omar? Yep, good pump fake. Post down Kyrie. Easy lay. Yes, sir. Four points for Omar. I think he's actually leading the squad. Suggs has four. He has Sugg. He, he has Suggs. He has four. They both have four. Oh, good steal. Cole Anthony. All the way. All the way. Yep. Collins, Collins, pump fake. It didn't pump fake it. He went for the layup. I'll still take the easy two, though. They put in Gafford. I think that's the only substitution they made. Nope. They're going to leave Hardy in there. Hardy dunks on John Collins. Okay. John, you got to watch out, buddy. You are going to get postered. They're taking your poster powers away. Uh, John Collins, here. Let's let's give them one. Let's let's give them one. Oh, no. I lost the ball. Hardy, give them a poster if you don't even have the ball. Oladipo, can we please cover on Rui? Nope. Not gonna work there. We're down five. Uh, we're not playing the best. Oladipo though, he's he's better than Kuzma. Good screens, John Collins. Look at the oop. He catches it. That's what we're talking about. Not no poster, but that Lob City finisher comes in clutch every once in a while. This game is much closer than our last one against the Bulls here. We are, you know, we're actually down two, which I didn't think we were gonna say, but Denny Avisha pull up jumper and one Oladipo. That was an awful, awful foul. I'm bringing in Jovic, and I am bringing in John Collins. I'm going to run John Collins at the five, see what happens here. If it, you know, backfires on me, I'll take him out. But I think this is the first time we've seen Jovic in action, see what he can do. They want it to go to Suggs. I also turned on play calling just now. 
So I want to see if we can actually get some plays running and not just pick and screen, pick and screen, pick and screen. You know, I don't want to only do that for the whole game. So I put on the coaching offensive playbook. I also edited the playbook uh, a couple episodes ago, so I think we'll be okay. And he keeps playing great defense on Gafford. He can't get a rebound. Gafford is just absolutely eating us on the rebounds, but it's all good. We eventually got it. Oladipo all the way to the rack against Denny Avija, and he gets fouled. We saw in last episode that Oladipo still kind of has it. I mean, he not still kind of. He dropped 30 last game, so... That was really good to see. This game, he's kind of off to a slow start. These are his first two baskets of the game, and it's winding down to the end of the quarter, so I'm going to take him out. Now, Franz Wagner's an 80. I don't know how, but apparently Franz Wagner is balling this year. I mean, his potential's gone way up. Good block by Jonathan Isaac. That's why you're down there, big fella. That's why you're down there. Um, I need to pull it out, run a play. Slow, slow it down. Slow it down. Let's go, Jovic. Uh, oh, yep. Wide open three, yes sir, and he fouls? Oh my god, okay, I thought I was just gonna waste the possession there with a missed three, but he fouls, so we're going back to the line. Shout out Jaden Hardy for the foul, I really do appreciate it. I will take the three free points any day of the week, which actually gives us the lead now, and we green all but the last one. But hey, we now up by three, and those fouls gave us that lead. So I'm bringing in Mojave King and Ivy. We're going to bring Collins back in at the power forward. We gave Jovic his a little bit of experimental minutes. I don't want to play him a lot as Cole Anthony gets a foul. Awesome. Kyrie Irving second in the all-star race. Ben Simmons third. And look at that. Jalen Suggs in eighth. You know, I'll take eighth out of anything. I mean, I know it's not first or third or second. But 8th is better than ninth and 10th, so, you know, shout out to Jalen Suggs. I did not think he would even get any votes this year, so that's pretty cool to see. I'm surprised John Collins isn't getting any votes, but I guess it's understandable. Denny Avija, I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that right. He's playing pretty well. I mean, he just drew a foul. I think he has like four or six points already, so shout out to Denny. Now, I won't lie. I'm not actually a fan of Denny Ad Ad Advia. I think I just heard the announcer say it something like that. I don't like him. Only because Denny's, you know, when I was younger, bro, I thought Denny's was so gas. Don't get me wrong. I thought it was the best breakfast joint in the world. Uh, but as I got older, I realized it's complete dog. It's it's bad. It's awful. And it's just not something you should spend your money at. I also don't have a Waffle House where I'm at. So my only alternatives was IHOP and then, like, regular restaurants and then their versions of breakfast. So, like, oh, my God, that block was nasty. Just served you up some scrambled eggs right there. Get toasted. Um, but enough of the breakfast puns. Yeah, the only real breakfast places I ever had growing up was, like, IHOP and, you know, McDonald's breakfast and, like, you know, the fast food type breakfasts. Other than that, there's no breakfast restaurants near me. I might be missing one, but I think... Oh, I can't believe I just missed that shot. I think IHOP is the only one. We do not have a Waffle House. I wish we, I wish we did, but we don't. Um, I don't consider Dunkin' and Starbucks breakfast restaurants because they're fast food. They're, they're like coffee joints, but it's all I had, man. IHOP and Denny's, and I used to think Denny's was amazing. But now that I'm older uh, and not stupid, I do now know that Denny's is trash. Now, if you've made it all the way to this part of the episode, let me know down in the comments who has the best city jersey in the league right now. I posted a poll the other day. I only really gave five op. Oh, that's an offensive three seconds. I gave like five options and I gave four of the best jerseys I personally enjoy. And then I just put other, other but no one commented other. Like, two people were like, oh, no, it's these, not it's these. I'm really curious to know what you guys think are the best city jerseys. So, if you've never even commented before on my channel, this is the time to do it. Change it. Uh, let me know which city jersey is your favorite. I really am interested to know. Because I, you know, I think I got to go with my favorite being the Houston Rockets or maybe the Hornets. It's one of those two, but the Houston Rockets are so damn clean. Is Jaden Ivey, how do you miss that layup right there? Daniel Gafford is eating us alive on the rebounds right now. He's going crazy. Kyrie, you just missed a very, I don't, I don't know what kind of shot was. Jaden Ivey, can we post up Kyrie? I know you got that post fader in you. Nope, never mind. Spin. Why did you spin and why did you miss? Secondly, I don't know. That was a really awful take right there please don't pass to Kyrie Mojave King good block oh my god Mojave King just blocked Kyrie we're fine we're absolutely cool and Jaden Ivy all the way to the rack give me that dunk you missed it no 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 you're kidding you're kidding you're no he missed how did you miss that dunk that would have been so sick and now the alley they missed dunk can nobody make a dunk is dunking not allowed what is happening here what like Everyone is just attacking me. 
Omar in the corner, pump fake, because I know he can't, he actually has a B plus three, I didn't realize that, let's take it, uh, no, bad, bad idea, Daniel Gaffer just absolutely embarrassed me. We're back here, we are in the second quarter, Oladipo's back in, we got our bench rocking, what play are we trying to run here? What are you, what are you trying to run here? Okay, I'm in my spot, give it to Jovic, give it to Cole, what are you, what play is this? Oh, I see. Get Suggs wide open for three. I like this play. I like this play. Green beat. Well, not quite a green. That was an awful release, but gives us the lead. Jalen Suggs shooting pretty well here. Uh, Cole Anthony passing the rock really well. And uh, can we talk about Cole Anthony uh, in real life real quick? This man has been phenomenal. Kuzma? Is that the real? Okay, Kuzma. Kuzma just hit that, but Cole Anthony, dude, I, he's averaging like nine rebounds a game as a point guard. Uh, that's kind of nuts. Why do we give it to Jovic there? Definitely didn't want to do that. Actually, maybe we do. We got Suggs here. You can't even guard me, Jonas. You can't guard me. Just kidding. Yo, okay, that was a really awful possession. I'm sorry, I lied. Cole Anthony is hooping. He's averaging like 19, six and six, something crazy like that for the Magic. I don't know. One night he had 18 rebounds and like 20, 30 points, something like that. So he's been really impressive this year. And Valanciunas has been super impressive as well with no Zion on the Pelicans. He's kind of like their only hope. And he's been playing very, very well as Gafford and Rui are eating me alive down low. We got the bench in. Well, not really the bench. We just Jovic, Isaac. Uh, not really the type of dudes I'm looking to have in right now is Jovic. I don't know what that fader was. Why did you fade? Why did you fade? No. On the topic of Valanchunas, uh, I posted a poll on my Instagram, by the way. Little Codeine, follow me on all platforms. I don't know why you don't. If you don't, you're missing out. I post some fun content. Uh, but, yeah, I posted on Instagram a poll of his stats and Bam Abada uh, stats. I can never pronounce his name, so I just make fun of myself when I try to say his name. But I posted him and Bam's stats on Instagram. I didn't say who was who, and I said, hey, which player would you rather have on your team? And, like, a, I think it was 76% of you guys, or whoever, you know, it follows me on IG, voted for Valanchunas to be the better player over Bam. So that was cool to see. Um, obviously, I think we all know Bam is considered the better player, but so far to start the season, the season, Valanchunas has been much more impressive as Old Depot already has his fourth. Get him out of here. Get, no, nope, Franz, you can come on in. I'm gonna bring in Whiteside. I wish it was Pirtle. I need to fix rotations. Maybe he's injured and I just didn't pay attention, but Whiteside and your seven are gonna be my two guys down low. I need some defense badly here. I'll just keep all the scoring to Suggs. Cole Anthony is tired. We'll... Uh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Uh, I'm going to take him out for Ivy because Ivy's pretty good defensively. So we'll have that. You're seven all the way. Denny Advija cannot stop you. He's just a bum. He's a, he's a white boy. Yeah, let's go. You're seven, you beast. You absolute monster. I mean, man, I could score with him too. But we're going to put in Ivy at the point guard. He can play defense as well. We're going to kind of run a defensive lineup here. We're going to take out Franz. I'm going to put in Jonathan Isaac. Everyone's going to be playing defense except Jalen Suggs right now. Uh, Omar, Omar, you need to guard that, okay? Dude, and Gafford is a beast. I'm gonna be real, Gafford is insane. So, that's wild. Shout out Shat. Um, you know, I don't, I, okay. You know what I've noticed? I think I've said shout out Shat or shout out a random subscriber like every single video because a player, will, I'll, I'll see a player and I'm like, oh, hey, that person, that person, you know, Ryan reminds me of this. So it's funny. I think it's it's just cool. Um, but I think every time I see an Australian or a Wizards player, I have to say shout out Shat. I just, it has to happen. So shout out you, Shat. Now it's getting close. It, it's getting awfully close. We're only down by two here as I don't, I don't know what you're trying to do, trying to score on white side. White side has been huge so far, by the way. Um, don't know. I did not expect him to be as good as he is. This is a good dunk, but Hassan Whiteside has been great on defense. He's been able to get his rebounds, and he's actually scored a good bucket, like a good couple of buckets, not a lot of them, but a good group. Oh my God, Jaden Hardy, that was filthy, but he scored very meaningful of buckets is what I should be saying, and uh, I kind of love to see it. It's kind of great here. Uh, what are we running for this play? It looks to be get Ivy open here. Did not work. Jaden Hardy, you play pretty good defense. We're going to try and put up a layup. Once again, Ivy can't make a layup for the life of him. So, Oladipo, you can come in at small forward right quick. I can't believe I jumped on that. That is my bad. Jonathan Isaac, you're really tired. You're going to have to come out, and we're going to put Jovic in at center. And we're going to keep Collins for kind of the very, very end of the game because I rely on him for scoring. Between him and Suggs and Cole Anthony, he can definitely be my guy. So, I'm going to keep him, you know, healthy and on the bench as long as I can, and then I'll bring him in. And I will play him as Oladipo uh, is about to come in. 
And Whiteside, man, he's doing what they need him to do in the few minutes he comes and plays. Oh my god, Suggs, please get this layup. Yes, sir, we tie it up. That was a beautiful find, a beautiful lay, beautiful movement, absolutely just gorgeous everything. It's just so, it's wonderful, okay? It's great things to see. 17 seconds, there's like a point three differential in the shot clock. Ivy on Dinwiddie, Dinwiddie trying to go to the bat. Oh, you can't do that. You can't. You can't on me. It doesn't. Oh, never mind. It does matter because he's bad. Uh, Suggs, last second shot. Yes, sir. Pull up. Green bean. Buzzer. Beater. No. Jonathan Isaac, please. Yeah, no. You could have. Okay. It's fine. We're rolling in the fourth quarter. It's time to get this W. We're down three. Um, I really need to pull out the big guns here, aka run post up plays. Jovic, they want me to shoot it with you. Please don't let me down. Okay, they didn't let me down. They didn't let me down. Hey, shout out Jovic, man. Jovic, back on with Dinwiddie. Can we do it again? Another post-magic play. Yes, sir, Jovic. You got the fancy finish. Oh, my God. Up and under. Scoopty doopty whoopty. Shout out Kanye West. Uh, we, I don't know how we got that to go. Hey, but, hey, we up. We up and we good. Jovic is playing great. This is the first like time he got meaningful minutes, and I foul. Suggs is first, but it's fine. I needed him to get out of there. France Wagner is actually not doing too great. Oh, Whiteside is tired. I'm sorry. He's going to have to deal with it. He's going to have to deal with it. Let's see what our bench can put together before we bring in the big guns here. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Yo, Mojave, splash that. Green bean, Mojave King, the rookie, coming in clutch when we need it. Two-point lead. This man, hey, I guess it's a good time. I put the bench in fouling because I don't know what I'm doing. We're going to be in the bonus probably here. That could screw us, actually. Fouling might be the reason we lose this game. Hey, you guys just got to survive for 30 more seconds. Don't let them score too much, and we're going to be fine. Franz Wagner. Oh, you're here. Yo, what's good, Franz? Oh, get by Kuz? Get by Kuz? No, but Jovic. Jovic, easy basket. No way you missed that layup. I said easy basket, and you missed it. It was an easy basket. You silly guy. You silly goose, you. Dinwiddie, play great defense. Ivy. Ivy, you're even better on defense. You lock up King Mojave. The rookie's going crazy to save the day. Valid shoot is with a great defense. What is happening? We still got four minutes. We're fine. We're fine. Whiteside with the... What is, what is this defensive showcase? Thank you, Whiteside. Big dunk, Mojave King. They need a time out. Dude, shout out to the rookies. They're going crazy. They may have just iced this game. All right. The rookies might have iced this game. Listen, listen. I, I know I'd say I put the starters in. I started the substitution, but we'll see how long I, you know, until I regret this. Oh, yep. Valanchunas. That's a foul. You're kidding. Okay, everyone's going to get subbed out anyway here because Jovic just fouled. But rookies are doing good. Got to give it to him. Suggs has 18. Collins has 9. And I think our next score is Mojave King. So, hey, shout out to the rooks. But we got our bench in here. Actually, it might be Omar and then Mojave. I think Omar actually has more than Collins. Is Collins great cut to the basket? Give us a dunk. That's easy. Suggs picks up his second assist. We're up four here. We have turned the tides. All thanks to the rookies. The rookies gave us that momentum we needed. Now it's up to Kyrie to, uh, you know, kind of save the Wizards here. Oladipo. Oh my God, that was the most filthy play I have ever. Oladipo, what did you just do to Kyle Kuzma? I think he just teleported. He just, can we watch that again? I need to watch that back. I need to watch that back. I don't know what just happened. He just I might have almost just got hurt. But look at this. Look at this. We got him on the corner. I go whoop, swoop around. And then I jump. He jumped from there. He jumped from the A. Went through Kuz. I not asking any questions. That was a beautiful, masterful dunk. Thank you, Oladipo. Green Bean, that's a three-point play. We're up five. Oladipo, rookies, everyone just piecing together this W. Hopefully, hopefully. We still got three minutes to go. There's still a lot of time, but I'm feeling confident. Hey, we got a one we got a one point lead. We got some things to do. We got some work. Oladipo wide open mid-range. Can he hit it? No. It's all good. Omar gets the clutch rebound out to Collins. Collins for the mid right. How did he miss? I don't know how he missed. Okay, okay, we're down one. We're down one. I'm no longer confident. I'm no longer confident. Yes, I am. John Collins exists. John Collins exists. Yup, yup. He's too strong. Too strong. There we go. 13 points, John Collins. Thank you. One point lead. Minute to go. Two minutes to go. Oh, the depot. Suggs in the corner. Splash that three, buddy. Yes, sir. Suggs with the dagger, man. I, I, I said that earlier. Okay, I said the rookies had a dagger. I mean, there was like five minutes left, so I guess not. That one made more sense. Kyrie, you ain't making that. You ain't making that. Good board. Suggs, go off. Go off, bro. 
Yup, Suggs all the way around Kyrie. You can't play defense. Easy layup. Jalen Suggs is the best. I, I'm sorry for ever doubting him. I used to talk trash. I used to say I don't like playing through. Dude has 23 and is going ham. Cole Anthony having an off night. It does not matter. It does not matter. He's playing good defense. He has five assists. He's sharing the rock. Kyrie can't score on him. Omar Yurt7 has a double-double. Ola Depot. I don't know what you're doing. We gotta, we gotta play through Suggs. Suggs, do whatever you want, buddy. Do whatever you want. John Collins, nice, beautiful cut, and the dunk. That's it. It's over. Eight-point lead, 52 seconds. Kyrie Irving, you are nothing to us. We got this game in the bag. The Orlando Magic are back, baby. Suggs and Collins are leading us to the... F okay, maybe not the finals. Maybe I'm getting ahead of ourselves. But we're definitely going to the playoffs. We are doing... We've just played phenomenal to start the season. And Suggs, man, is a beast. Oh, my Lord. I mean, one heck of a W on New Year's here. Jalen Suggs, 24 points, 4 assists, 2 steals. And we shot 8 for 14. Pretty good game. 15, 6, and 1 for John Collins. Double-double for your 7. Mojave King, he played some meaningful minutes. In the 8 minutes, he played uh, 9 points. And Jovic had 8 and 5. Another good showing by that rookie. Oladipo had a tough night tonight, but it's fine. He just dropped 30 in the last episode. Franz Wagner kind of sucked tonight. Whiteside, once again, he comes in for like a couple seconds and does everything I need him to do. So, shout out Hassan Whiteside. Cole Anthony, not the best night, but hey, two steals, five assists. I'll take it with him. And then Isaac had seven rebounds, two blocks. He's, you know, testing him out at center. And then Ivy, not the best game. And obviously, Michael Carter Williams didn't play. Kyrie, he had 15 points, and that's really the only thing I should talk about. Jaden Hardy, you're averaging 21, but you suck tonight. So, I mean, five for 12, bad. Kyrie, seven for 21, bad. Y'all are awful. We get a great W here in Washington. I love to see it. We are having one heck to the start of the season we are currently the third seeded team in the eastern conference but i want to know what happened to Jakob. oh wait did i no Jakob's still here he's just not playing why is he not wait a minute what did i mess up in the rotations because he should definitely yeah he's in the 13th slot let's move him to the 12th slot and honestly i don't want to put him over white side because white side comes in and does what i need him to do so i'm very happy with that and jovic you were so sad like, I, I'm sorry, man. I will uh, Listen, I'm going to give you more minutes. I'm sorry. You're not in the G League anymore. You're now in the big leagues, and you just had a great game. So don't even cry, man. Paul Millsap, I'm sorry that you're just not getting any minutes, but you, you don't deserve them minutes. I'm sorry. I'm not playing an old dude. I'm not the Boston Celtics. I'm not going to play, uh, you know, old vets over my young guys. Old Adipo, uh, just don't worry about him, okay? He's averaging 16 this season. He's fine, okay? Don't, don't yell at me. I know he's old and a vet, and I should play other guys over him, but... I like Isaac off the bench, and same thing with Franz. Ivy's been playing great. They want me to play Mojave King for 32 minutes. What? I mean, he played better than Ivy, so maybe we do. Maybe we do that. I don't know, man. You, let me know in the comments, because I don't. I don't know what to do with these two. But Mojave, they want me to play him 32 minutes. It's kind of crazy. I appreciate you guys watching this episode. Make sure you like up. Let me know your favorite city jersey down below in the comments, and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a great night. Like up, sub up, all those cool things. Peace. I'm the bees, knees, bees, hoes. Yeah, they just love me. Flow so cold, but my nose straight runny. Got a lot of bros, so don't act funny. Shooting off shots, gun hopping like a bunny. Run up on me, you a motherfucking dummy. You know I do these drugs.